Hi right, guys, I'm here. Pretty nice community. This is the first one um, on 313107 57th. All right, so we do have the busy street, Lone Mountain Road right there. So if you had a horse, I think the challenge would be just getting out of here um, with the horse, which you could, I guess, go on the road. But beautiful home here. This thing is uh, from the outside, really well kept. The paint looks immaculate and it's uh it's like a smooth stucco it's really nice the community itself here is just one street long but really beautiful homes here looks like we got some baseball um fans a lot of uh nets in the back here batting cage style i think this home might have something like that in the back but um this driveway should accommodate all generations of your family. It's a really, really large area here. Beautiful home from the outside. Let's go check out the inside. All of your meters are right here. Looks like it might have solar. I have to look into that. Let's see. <sighs> Yeah, I think this is solar, so we have to figure that out. Sometimes the leases aren't worth it. I, I don't see that prohibiting a sale or anything, but it just it's just not worth it out here yet. Used to be, until they changed the rules. All right, uh, beautiful door here. It's like nine feet. This thing is tall. I mean, I go up to... I go up to like right here, so you have another like four feet. That might be a, that's like nine and a half feet. It's a big door. Beautiful area here, little entrance over there as well. Find out where that goes and here we go. This is cool. Beautiful. So let's get a good video here. No, I just said that. It's not like I'm getting a bad video, right? So this is pretty cool. You walk in, just want to show you the ceiling here. It's very grand, really nice. So in this living space, you have the kitchen, which extends through. That's nice. I thought that was just going to be a wet bar. Really big, beautiful kitchen. Kind of reminds me of the one on Dixaletta. That is real beautiful. And it goes through to here. Not a huge TV in there. But you could always mount something to go to stick out a little bit. Um... I would imagine that's a gas fireplace, but I can't tell. I'm gonna look for you, and in the meantime, just give you a better view of the front here. Yeah, there's a gas uh, key, so it's a gas fireplace. Classic travertine tile, wood floor. Let's go to this uh, wing first. And uh, in here we have 10 foot ceilings as we're walking through as well, so it doesn't feel like you're enclosed as you walk in. So this is cool, kids room. And obviously doors leading to the outside. Really big closet here. Some nice wooden doors. Just gotta put those little sticky things on the bottom to keep them from swinging. Get those at Home Depot, no big deal. All right. So very large room. I don't know who would be Upset about having a room that big, along with the bathroom in here as well. There's kids in the baseball, it looks like. Shower, um, single vanity there. Uh, nice drawers, dovetail uh, drawers here. Some, uh, soft clothes as well. Shower, not much to it. Just going to get that angle for you. Big... 
kind of, I don't think they're solid, but they're beautiful doors. These are all real nice. Uh, all right. Closet here looks like some kind of central vac system along with um, the data stuff right there. Not too exciting. We've got a half bath over to the left here. And remember, we had just walked in from there, from the uh, living room. Okay, over here on the right, little kid's room. Um, it's not really like wide this way, but it's really long. So plenty of room here, no complaints. And it also has a bathroom. Very nice. Yeah, spacious. I'd be happy to have this room. Over here we have our laundry room. Right across the way, it looks like we have a little leak going on in the sink. Oh, no, but it shut it off. We're good. Plenty of cabinet space. Yeah, nice cabinets. So right here, doesn't look like a master, but you have a closet here right when you walk in. And uh, speakers in this particular one. So this is just another guest room with a bathroom. Right when you walk in there. Okay. Uh, pretty big shower in this one. It's kind of nice. I don't see, as far as condition of everything, it looks really nice. I mean, you know, the walls look really well cupped. I'm not like a huge fan of this carpet, but I wouldn't replace it. It looks newer. Um, volume control for the one speaker in this room as well. I didn't see volume or speakers in the other rooms. Let me see. Oh, they do. They got speakers going throughout all the rooms here. It's kind of cool. Uh, linen closet here to the left, in case you were wondering what this is. Oh, it looks like they got some games in there and towels and just random, random stuff. Okie dokes. That is the uh, north wing. Let's go through here. Yeah, beautiful. Oh, I was like, what's that noise? So a little dishwasher right there. It's like a little drink dishwasher, maybe. And then another dishwasher here. Double sinks. I mean, this is a nice uh, cooktop here. Vented above. All is decor is the brand. There's that pot filler. Yeah, this is... This is really nice, guys. Yep. That's interesting. RO system down here for our drinking water. That's cool how they did that. Nice big pantry here. And then it goes over to the left to store some uh, other longer items. And this has a really dramatic ceiling with some uh, a circular band of uh, lights there. Double oven as well, same brand decor, and the fridge is sub-zero, and a decor built-in microwave to the right there. So, looks a little shallow, but plenty of space to fit. I mean, you can throw a whole elk in here and call it a day. Yeah, great kitchen. Little TV up there as well. Ceilings are about uh, 20 feet high. They're, they're tall, maybe 15. Another living room over here. So this is the more, you know, maybe the kids hang out here. You guys hang out in the other one. But you can see you have a full pass right there. Very nice here. Cool um, design up here, this tray ceiling. It's like a blob type of shape. Looks cool. 
Nothing weird. Yeah, I, I like it. Once again, clean, smells clean, no weirdness going on. Up here we have like a little sitting space. I don't really know what to do with this. They just put a piano and obviously two chairs. But uh, yeah, this is, this is a cool house. Jeez, there's an upstairs too. All right, wet bar right here. If you don't quite want to go into the kitchen. Some beers in there and a wine fridge as well. So this looks like a little office space. So if you didn't want to walk into the house and or out of the house, that's really nice. And these are uh, 10 foot ceilings. Yeah, beautiful room. Floor, it's just a hardwood floor. It's pretty, uh, pretty sturdy. Oh, bathroom here as well. Yeah. And that's it for over here. I think this is going to be a door leading out to the backyard. It's going to be a long video, isn't it? No, this is a door to the garage. Okay. So four car garage here. Oof, excuse me. It's been a long ride. All right. Um, closet space back here as well as, uh, should say cabinets as well as a little nook there for bicycles to go right here and you can still fit a car parked here and i mean you could fit this is a longer garage so you could fit any type of truck in here no issues i don't see soft water i do see a hookup for electric car do not see soft water if you guys wanted to install that no big deal okay Heading upstairs. This carpet's fluffy. It's got a fluff feel. I feel like I should take my shoes off. I'm gonna do that. Give me a sec, okay. Those there, hopefully don't forget them. Oh, so this is just a little loft space right here. Okay. Kinda like that other house had that little upstairs area. So that's all that is. Uh, nine foot ceilings here, I believe. So no, no, it's 10 foot, 10 foot as well up here. Okay. Um, I don't know where the master is. Let's not have, let's not have gone into it. Sorry, losing, losing my breath here. I went up three stairs. Whew. Ugh. All right. Is there another room somewhere? Am I missing something? Okay, I hope I didn't get the, ma okay, here's the master. I was gonna say, if that was the master, it'd probably be, probably be out. So this is a cool location for it. Oh, here it is. Tray ceiling, double tray ceiling actually. Gas fireplace here, curtains with a slider right to the left. And here's the view kind of looking out into the uh, living areas. Okay. Let's go over here into the bathroom. So we had carpet here. This carpet's pretty worn. I'll get rid of it. Okay. I mean, it's not dirty. It's just worn. All right. Bathroom, super clean. Very nice. Little fan up there. This closet uh, looks like you're gonna share. Someone's got the left side, someone's got the right side, okay? So it's working, got a lot of built-ins here, pretty cool. I gotta do something like that for my shoes. And uh, shower's nice and big. Dual, dual sprayers up there with the rainfall. Spout coming from the ceiling and a really long bench right here. So plenty of space here. Looks like you have, oh, they have all these uh, extra squares on here so you can get those extremities clean. And uh, yeah, toilet room, gotta get a shot of that. Just to prove it's here, it's here. Okay, good sized bathroom. I don't feel like there's any wasted space. 
We'll see if we can keep that. Okay, yeah, pretty, pretty nice. That TV fits perfectly in there. Speakers in there as well, I, I think, right? Yeah, no, yeah, no speakers in there. What the? Oh yeah, there are speakers. This is one speaker over there and one speaker over there. So, okay, let's check out the outside. Then we'll move on to the next one here. We got a tight schedule today. Oh, ooh, nice sliders. Slide really well. They don't feel too challenging. And then uh, you can actually pocket these guys, which is pretty cool. So, you know, you got all that open there. And you can do it to that side as well. So you can have this whole mamma jamma right there open. So, backyard, pretty big space. To the right, little sitting area right outside the master bedroom, along with a grill area here. Now you're wondering what the condition is. Ah, looks looks usable. Looks old, but you know that's fine. Uh, looks like it's got gas hookup down there. Okay, pool is uh, it's like medium size. I mean, it's good size. Baja shelf over here. Yeah, I mean, plenty of room to get crazy. A lot of mesquite trees back there. I'll uh, have somebody do the lawn. Where did that come from? Where was that? Did I go in that room? Is that one of the, oh, that was one of the kids' rooms, yeah. That was the kids' room, the baseball guy. Okay. So over here, plenty of space, I mean, you know, eight, six, you know, what is it? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 feet or something right over there. So really big yard. Okay. I'm gonna actually go to the, go over by the, I think those are horse stalls over there. Check it out. Oh boy, can I screw this up? Okay. Ooh. Oh, there we go. Oh. You have a little muscle to close these. Sorry about that. Okay. Interesting mesquite tree here. Looks like a bonsai. Palo Verde. That's all I know. Don't be impressed. Uh, pool equipment looks like pool equipment. Nothing too special about it. A couple pumps there. Um, I, I, I don't know what that is. That's a blower or what that deal is. Or, Anyways, looks like it's in good condition. Let's go check it out here. So, still, I don't know how to open this. There we go. Okay. So this is where, this is where you keep the animals, looks like. A lot of space over here. And that came from the other living room over there. There's a slider right there, easy access out here. So you could, uh, yeah, you can do whatever you want over here. This looks like a horse stall or a bat. I thought it was a batting cage. I think they had it set up for a batting cage. Yeah, because there's the, there's the pitcher thing. And so yeah. You can throw some horses under here. That's what it was set up for. And uh, I imagine you can put some over there. Oh, here we go. This kid practiced pitching too. He's got a home plate right there with a guy batting. So, all right, that is it, guys. This shed, I, I mean, I guess I can go in. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, this looks a little, looks a little that's where you keep your uh, Christmas stuff, apparently, and your anything else, skeletons. This opens and um, it just opens that way, it looks like. So that's your, that's your yard there. And beautiful home. Only complaint would be that it's next to the Lone Mountain area, but, uh, you know, doesn't seem like that uh, bothers you guys, but it's a 
well-kept place from what I can see. No complaints. And you do have misters over here. You got misters there. They look like pretty good commercial misters. Let me go back in and then I'm going to head out and uh, see if there's... Yeah, there's misters over here too and they got the lines coming down from the bottom. So keep you nice and cool if you guys are going to be here at all in the summer. So those are what those are right here. All right, guys. See you on the next one.